Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing uh, or showcasing some League of Angels 2 uh, stuff. And this account here is pretty powerful for his level and whatnot. And we're going to take a look at him and I'll hopefully give good advice. It's been a while since I've made this. Also, for another fun fact, I got the watch. Yay, so okay, I've never worn a watch before so it's going to be interesting. But yeah, without any further ado, let's get right into it. GT Arcade, yeah, this is the only way you can showcase this. Because the client doesn't support 4K monitors, uh, which is kind of odd in my opinion. How did that happen? I'll add Yoda, by the way. One. Uh, well, the friend list is full. So Dragon is 2.5 billion bat rating, um, with not much gold or anything. Uh, we're going to take a look at Tycoon. We're going to fight someone in the... Battle Royale. His mount is kind of nice. I like that. He's whip 7 for right now, level 86. I think this server is probably pretty new. What rank is he anyway? He is rank 1 with a lot actually. He's he, <laughs> he's kind of crushing the rest. 2.5 meanwhile number 2 is 800 million. So this should be actually quite kind of fun to fight some people. Uh, so yeah, let's get right into it. I don't recall how I used to do it, I think I started on squad and then I worked my way over to hero, then equipment, then relic, then mount and whatnot. We'll see. So he's using uh, berserker things. How does he have this much bat rating with berserker things? That's what I don't understand. Helm of justice, you shouldn't have this much. Well, he's only 65 million bat rating on his main, so he's definitely a one hero focus or on some other heroes. Also, I have not seen that hero before, so that's kind of cool. His skills is Sorcerer's Might, deal attack to an enemy and reduce uh, their uh, attack and defense. Oh, man, okay. It's a random enemy, I assume, because it just doesn't say that it's like the highest one. Also making sure I'm recording. And then we have Magician's uh, Magician Blast, deals attack to an enemy with the highest attack. The higher the target's current HP, the more damage this will deal. Okay, so the highest, higher the HP. Isn't there a hero that does that? Uh, I don't recall who, but there's a hero. Force Aura to increase attack. Crushing Might. Uh, I do suggest using, uh, of course, uh, Enraged Might. And I suggest using Pacifying Aura. Uh, it's the most useful ones for main, I think. Anyway, for... Yeah. Also, yeah, you're Evolution 2, by the way. Not Augment 2. You're evol Evolved 2. Then you have your main focus... With 1.9 billion bat rating, 147 million HP, 67 million attack. You'd give my Pamela a run for her money. I think you'd probably win. With a 10 star Dragon Blade, I must say, 10 star, uh, 10 star uh, artifact gear, that's expensive. That's rather insane. So nice job with that. That's a crazy, crazy sword, which gives a lot of stuff, like a lot of attack. Uh, even it's level 166. It's difficult to wait. Is is there a never mind? This is a dragon blade. Never mind. It's it's difficult to upgrade. Don't get me wrong, but it's not the next tier, which is another tier, I guess. But it's it's pretty damn insane. Off anyway. I don't have a 10 star, not nearly a 10 star on my Pamela. Then you have an eternal home and belt. I don't understand why you focused so much. Well, okay, never mind. I understand why you focused on armor to have a chance to rev to to revive yourself. But yeah, typically magical defense is better than physical. But it that doesn't matter. It also, HP is important. <laughs> so, but yeah, I understand why I focus on the armor. It's to respawn, so it's understandable. You have crit on her. Uh, her skills. Stealing a lot of damage to lowest enemy HP things and put death marks on them. Also, Shadow Mistress, she's a cool looking hero. Remove the increased skill for each mark. Okay. Sorry that I'm yawning. I really am not meaning to. I just woke up, so that may be why. Uh, so, it's these skills are kind of turning into the Age of Angels 1 skills. It's a lot of details. Like, uh, deals damage to those HP 70%, steals to the t to enemies around the target, uh, deal mark of death on the target, which heals them. Percent attack damage is run for 2 rounds and stacks up to 5 times. This effect ignores immunities, cannot be dispelled. This skill replaces here. Hero specific attack, which is also quite insane. It's a very high percentage to, re to be normal, you know. During battle, gain 1 stack of decay, each hero, each time a hero dies, decay increases. Where were you? 
Oh, we may have to edit this video heavily. Decay <laughs> increases own attack and defense by 10% per stack up to 3 stacks. Does stack last forever though? Uh, it doesn't say that it expires, so I assume so. Gain 200 rage each time a hero dies. Own agility is reduced by 8% in battle. Okay, so she's a bit slower, I suppose. Uh, that was this one. What about the Eye of the Future prototype? A unique effect, Reaper, increase attack of the entire squad by 30%, that's crazy, off her attack, which is even more insane. Uh, she is immune to rage, scaling, st rage stealing and immune effects. Uh, she is uh, stronger on ultimate skill and she restores HP each round passively, which is nice. Before performing an action, restore 30% to the... Okay, why is she doing that? I don't understand that, like, what's the point in focusing on the- I don't- this is the most useless uh, grace skill ever for her. Like, she's your main focus, why does she need to heal the others? They're dead- in a good- in a battle versus a similar enemy, they're dead anyway, so what's the point in trying to heal them? Because it's to an ally, right? It's not to yourself, it's not to Shadow Mistress, so... This is literally the most useless grace skill ever for her, I think. Also, legendary level 60, uh, uh, seal, S something like that, <laughs> and volcanic rune stone, plus 7, level 13, which isn't too bad. I think you need, um, I think this takes time, because you need to do it with other people, or something like that, I don't recall. Yeah, and then your Dora has uh, not really much focus, we're not really going to look at that. Uh, what skills do you have on the Wheel of Fate? Also, we need to take a look at your runes. Crit, dodge, hit, attack. Okay, so you have... Uh, <laughs> I can get behind this, but um, I don't understand. Well, I have crit damage, damage, and agility, and uh, lifesteal. Well, I could understand why you'd have it like this. I don't... My memory doesn't reach as far to give you any better advice on that. It seems alright, I suppose. I, I guess... Um, yeah, we'll take a look at Hourglass, because here I kinda know. Uh, res dodge right, okay, restores rage per turn. Okay, I like this one, I like this one. Yeah, you're a, you're a dodgy, 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 dodgy person. <laughs> Not in a bad way, she's a dodgy character, you could say. Level 9 dodge runes, uh, it's quite nice. Hero skin, I don't... Does she have a hero skin or not? She doesn't. I assume it's a new hero because I haven't heard about her, or maybe I've just been inactive. We could take a look at, uh, um, where is it, like, uh, is it Cultivate or Replace? I don't, I don't even, yeah, Cultivate, yeah, here we go, we could take a look at her dodge rate compared to everything else. Her dodge rate is higher, and this rather high block is obviously low because you can't get it from anywhere, really. Hit and crit is uh, quite good as well, but the dodge is pretty high. I think it's higher than my Pamela's dodge. I I don't remember though, but I think it is. I think it's a pretty good dodge. Uh, and she is uh, plus fourteen uh, augment, which is nice. Or evolution because she can't <laughs> she can't be augmented. She's just straight evolved. Dora plus seven. Uh, is she also augmented that way, or is she evolved? Okay, so she's just augmented. That doesn't surprise me. Flora, though, is... Um, she she should be yeah, Super Augment. And then we have a Salty, obviously, at Super Augment already. And, uh, yeah, Dora. And, and you, yourself is also augmented. So let's... Uh, well, evolve, my bad. So your, your main is uh, R7. Your Eye of the Future, Shadow Mistress, is pretty high. She's marked R16, with all of these being worked on. Which is super high, much higher than my Pamela again. Uh, I only have my main to compare to, I suppose, in, in this level of bat writing. R7 Dora, R7 Flora, R12 Isolde. So I assume you're kind of working on Isolde on the side right now. Uh, which I'm curious about. How, how does she fare? What's her bat writing? Uh, 393 million. It's rather low, and... Yeah, why are you... Well, R11 HP and R11... Uh, oh, I guess it's because you're not using those kinds of runes for your main. That makes sense. Okay, cool. Yeah, because you should definitely focus mainly on runes on Shadow Mistress. Yeah, like she's your main focus, right? And she's already...
pretty... How much bat rating? Is she 10 times higher than anyone? I assume she's 10 times ten times higher than anyone than Isolde. So I'd give this a... What what should I give this? It's, it's pretty massive, the difference. Like, it's all focused on her. I'll give it a... Ah... Uh, I guess I'll give it a 10 out of 10, actually. Like, there, that I, I wouldn't have done anything different, probably, at this point. So you've done a nice job. 10 out of 10 out of, um, the, like, the, the super own hero thing that I did before. If anyone remembers, because I don't. But that's fine. Animate, level 9, you're working on it. Super augment, 14, you're only missing gold, which is why you're poor. Holy shoot, so you can make your, like... 15, 6, you can make her 20 already, you just need a lot of gold. Okay, cool. Wish that they would give gold this year then. Seal? Uh, well, origin power is pretty high. Uh, you need a lot of these soul things. It's pretty high regardless, though, you have done a lot. Uh, then you're working on this legendary level 60. I assume you're soon at artifact at that point. Seal advancement, level 18 skill, rune attributes increased. Increases squad's agility, permanently increases on attack, converts damage done, yada yada yada. We will see in this one before, I think. At least I have, so I hope you have if you're playing this game. Um, okay, cool. Now that we've seen that, let's take a look at equipment. This is obviously no grade. This is no grade. This is no grade. This is a little bit of grade. However, uh, yeah, the sword is being worked on a lot. Um, where would this be? Upgrade? Yeah, upgrade is a thing here. It gives a lot of attack for sure. It gives equipment attack plus 330%, which is 602,000 attack, purely from the sword alone. And you're working on, uh, well, enchant is max, right? So I guess you're just working on grade 12, which requires a lot. And then you have armor higher for the, the for the defy death. I wouldn't mind you making this grade 10 or something, because if you made it grade 10, 10 it would be nice or no no wait wait it just increases the amount of hp you respond with it's still good don't get me wrong uh but i thought yeah maybe you should tensor this and then uh, eternal belt is plus four it is yeah you well uh grade seven grade six but yeah the pluses or the stars has already been seen uh but yeah the belt you i if i were you i'd try to get full full artifact gear and then i would work on uh like a higher grade uh, belt or something, higher grade armor. But yeah, belt, HP is very important, it's not only attack, so HP is very important. And yeah, could, you could ascend this to artifact at some point. Uh, no, not artifact, but you mean, I mean like the, the, whatever they call it. I don't even remember the name anymore, but you know what I mean, the next tier. <laughs> awaken tier, uh, weapon awaken tier, no. I don't want to lower the graphics. I use the 1080 Ti, like GTX, like I used to, I could play Ark in 4K and it's telling me, hey, this is a bit laggy, maybe you should turn down the quality, and I'm like, <laughs> okay, it's kind of funny. I'm not trying to brag about my own computer, but I'm kind of just being rude to the game for being so badly optimized that it requires a computer like this and it suggests to turn down the graphics. Anyway. Weapon tier 7, belt tier 7, this tier 6. I've always enjoyed making it like this, like weapon, belt, helmet, armor, weapon, belt, helmet, armor all the time. And I've always enjoyed having belt and weapon a tier higher. So this is perfect in according to how I would want it. And it's nice for like Tranquilora as well. I hope that you get this soon because it's ultra insanely overpowered. Tranquilora is insane. It's crazy, man. It's super crazy. So I hope you get that. Uh, I even have that on my, my on my main, I guess. Uh, Soul Avatar. I haven't really looked into this a lot, but I assume you have some nice stuff. A total battle bonus. You get a lot of agility, uh, some defense, uh, some attack. Uh, well, yeah, you get some agility. Uh, yeah, I looked at attack wrongly. It was kind of weirdly shown. Plus, you get a lot of dodge and a hit and agility and uh, crit. Not too much, actually, but yeah, you get a good amount of dodge, which is very nice. And you have all of these things right here, like a lot of mythic uh, or artifact things here. And yeah, these were massively nerfed, uh, so they're not as strong as they used to be, but yeah, this is quite nice. And you have inscribe at a lot of 60% HP. That doesn't count towards like overall, though. 
that's not, it doesn't give you overall 60% HP or something. It's just gives like the 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 the, the thing it like the soul of authority. If this gives entire like yourself 60% attack, then it's OP. And you have everything at level 60 already, which is kind of crazy. <laughs> crazy. So nice job. Recycle. We won't really do that. Codex. I'll claim that for you. Hopefully you didn't mind that. And you're working on. Um, yeah, you're working a little bit on everything, I suppose. One star. Yeah, well, okay, here we have two star. Yeah, so you're kind of just working on it. And it's giving not too much stats, honestly. Codex isn't too OP. Relics, we've already looked at runes. So we're just looking at the uh, engrave, I suppose. 69690090019. Okay, so you're, you just, I assume you need the yellow things. Uh, yeah, yes. You have a lot of resources, all right? You you have a lot of resources. Okay, 120 relic crystals. So that's what you're. That's what's stopping you. Also, yeah, if you look here, Valorium selection. Like you can. Oh, Valorium is the, is the thing, right? Yeah. Okay. So you, you have a lot of artifact things, battle pet augments, chests, equipment, and chest chests. I would I would literally just get uh, the two pieces to be uh, dragon type of thing. I would just do it immediately and then save the rest for later. It's just it's just worth it, honestly. I think it gives you like a set bonus or something. I don't I don't really recall, but it's just good to have everything artifact when you have the option to. And you have thirty one thousand dragon souls. You have so much of everything, man. You have a lot of everything. It's kind of ridiculous. You have 1,350,000 power essence, a lot of sun gems, uh, a lot of uh, food for the pets, uh, a lot, well, not too many blessing stones actually, a lot of pet stuff though, a lot of engraved stones, a lot of more pet stuff, um, uh, 17,000 seal vouchers. You have a lot of resources, uh, my dude, you have <laughs> quite a lot of them, I can see in every aspect, in every regard. Not too many of these actually, uh, and chance zones, but that's fine. Um, let's see here, twelve thousand. Yeah, you even have five thousand of those. I assume you're st still working amounts, because this is again a pretty early account. Like it's level eighty six. I don't know how old this server is, but I assume it's not too old. So this is a lot of progress in probably months, not even months. Uh, I'd assume. So yeah, it's it's a pretty nice account. Mount, you have a Nocturnus, you have a Unicorn, Moonlight Carriage. Also, may I say, only Whip 7? I don't think Whip 7 is high at all. And you've managed to get all of this just with Whip 7. That explains how easy it is to get good in this game with a small amount of money right now. Uh, Unicorn R8, R9, R5. But yeah, it's uh, R4. Uh, yeah, so you need to upgrade the Nocturnus a lot, I assume. Uh, R4, because R turns, uh, isn't this uh, the advanced level? Yeah, you see, you need advanced a lot. I, oh, yes, yeah, because you're working on Moon Knight Carriage for your, <laughs> for your Shadow Mistress. If I were to replace it, I'd probably replace it with, um, if you're all about dodge, right? If you, if you are a dodgy, dodgy person, <laughs> well, if you like dodge, right, or, I know for a fact that Ember Dragon does nicely, doesn't he? Let's see your advanced guide. But this is an old mount, so I'm sure there's better. Yeah, because this increases crit, crit damage and dodge. Uh, but I wouldn't be able to tell you which mount is better anymore uh, towards doing it. Because it's been, it's been just such a long time since I've played. So I can't really give you any good advice there. I just know that... Uh, I use uh, Vermilion Hawk. Vermilion Hawk is amazing, but there there are better ones, obviously now giving uh, immune to control when HP is. But you're already immune, so I don't I don't know anyone in the comments who's actually experienced at this. Let me know what what you would recommend for Dragon here, because uh, yeah, using the Moonlight Carriage in my opinion is a total waste. Uh, let's start with the battle pets. Uh, Ten star R12. One star R2. One star R2. Uh, if I were you, I'd honestly focus more on Grace Pets and more on on Mitz and Pixie. You wanna know why? You wanna know, know why? 
these guys can give you a lot of dodge, like a lot of dodge, just by being upgraded and being in grace or something like that. So they give you a lot of dodge. It's not necessarily most important to focus only on one pet. Just my opinion though, it's just my opinion. Also Kitsune isn't is she good damage to reduce her defense. Uh, I also am not good enough anymore at the game to advise a good pet. But what was popular all the time was either Leviathos or Grove Warden. If people are dodging a lot, then use Leviathos. If not, use Grove Warden. Uh, I think they're pretty good. Also, Baby Flipper. Like, every, everyone and their mother is using a Baby Flitter. Flip, Flitter. <laughs> so, Baby Flipper. Okay, uh, never mind. Scratch Leviathos and Grove Warden. Maybe Baby, baby Flipper. I've also seen uh, Sakura being used a lot. Uh, but yeah, Leviathos and Grove Warden, not to be underestimated. But yeah, your total grace kind of sucks because of, uh, yeah, that. Awaken is level 9, all you need is pet awakening crystals, uh, which you're getting over time. And grace is, is fine. And yeah, that, that's about it. Um, soul Arms. Titan Grip. Uh... Level 5, level 1. Well, we could just look at the enchants. enchants. Uh, so, yeah, again, you only only need brilliant gems. It's for 5, 9. Again, here it's cool to focus on otters as well, like once giving dodge. Like, it doesn't uh, this one give a lot of dodge? Uh, yeah, I think this one gives... I think Guardian Wings gives a lot of dodge overall. And yeah. Also, I think that this is a nice one to just use overall as well. I think it's a nice... Or, or, uh, a nice thing to use, but again, people can say something else if they want to in the comments. But yeah, Guardian Wings is kind of amazing. I think many people are using this one for your, for this, their soul arms. So just work on getting that, I suppose. Um, and yeah, upgraded a lot, obviously. And enhance, yeah, you could work on this, increase stuff as well. Titan Grip is useful early on though, but definitely not end game, which you probably know. End game soul arm. Rune Stone. Um, yeah, it's, it is what it is. You just need a lot of this, which you need from Elemental Shop or, and or just doing it. The, the thing, the thing. And this is uh, level 13 inscribed. You have a lot of, yeah, it's 46 out of 46. I like to, that you went that route. I enjoy this a little bit. I like the crit. I liked it. You should really go for the dodge, honestly, though. Like, skip these two. Skip those two, where I'm pointing right now. And then maybe even skip this one in the middle here. Get the three dodge. The dodge really does help. Um, the rest is okay. Uh, it's fine. You haven't... Well, you have a lot, gotten a lot of those inc inscribe markings as well. Uh, increase basic attack. That's not useful for you because she doesn't have a basic attack. If crit... Increase crit damage. If... Uh, it shuns... Okay. Not... Nothing too interesting. Uh, there is a... To not to remove that. Yeah, I guess fire penetration, but yeah, the, the skills of the volcanic rune stone isn't too great. But yeah, it's it's cool. And also, if you really want to do gold dodge, I'd go for the tsunami one, of course, the tsunami rune stone. But it's up to you. I don't know how dodgy your hero is. I actually have no idea. And you're getting some stuff from here as well. A lot of stuff. Holy crap! Yeah, you have a you have done this a lot. <laughs> this is crazy, man. I want to. I, never mind. I want to look one more time here at the, at the awakened stats of this one. It's a lot. Fourteen thousand nine hundred dodge. So yeah, you're definitely interested in dodge. So maybe you want to go higher, harder on it, I suppose. Um, here you have it. Uh, a molten giant with uh, hit and dodge increases hit and dodge. Then you have three gargoyles, which is fine. You can stack on the onto those later, of course. And it's giving you a decent. Some decent stats, nothing too great. Well, you can uh, multiply everything by like 10 because of all the percentages and bonuses. R7, star 9. All you really need is uh, the red jades, which is taking a while, I suppose. You need more of the refined stuff of everything, I think. Get some uh, HP and defense total. A little, a, a good amount of dodge, 4600. Yeah, so you're definitely heavily focused on dodge, that's for sure. Uh, let's over the legendary relics. Divine Eye, phase 5, phase 5, phase 5, level is 23, 70, and 78, yeah, it's because of the attack, I suppose. Yeah, you're definitely focusing on the attack one a lot. Law of Valor, yeah, just continue doing that, it's great. Justice Wheel, it is, it's not being worked on yet. Even Gifts of Prophecy, it's a new one, uh, so neat. <laughs> Neato Burrito, 
Okay, so who did you want me to fight again? I need to go over to Discord and actually look at the name because I don't remember. I have no idea. So I need to take a look at the name you wanted me to fight in Battle Royale. So let's do it. Also, we're going to fight a few people in your server as well. Or maybe, well, well, we'll replace that. We're, we'll replace that. Uh, so, there you are. Who did you want me to change? Q. K E E W. So let's see here if we can find K E E W. Uh, so we'll easy battle a lot, probably, right? I assume we will win. Um, if we find someone higher bat rating, we'll fight them, sure. If we find someone a higher bat rating, we'll fight them. But Q is our main objective. But yeah, if we find someone higher than 2 billion, like like higher than, than this guy's bat rating, we'll, we'll do that. As I guess Q is not really here right now. Glitter Soul. They're, they're pretty much the same bat rating. Let's take a look. They're using Isoldi. Isoldi is still a nice hero. I really enjoy Isoldi. But yeah, can you kill everyone in your bat real? That's a question, man. That's a question. I wonder if you can do that or not. Hold on, my hand is freezing. It's so cold in this room uh, during winter. I need to get like some kind of heater. Loading character resources. Are you going load? Are you going load? I also have to activate uh, fast and auto, I believe, because I haven't been on this character before. And we're still recording and audio is going fine, sure. Loading 3D graphics. Uh, let's uh, do that and that. Cool, challenge me please. No, go, go. No, go, go. Also, they're using Venus as an angel. I haven't even looked at the house. My bad, I need to do that. I forgot. I forget. Also, the battle is really laggy. I don't know why. Like, this is not on my end. <laughs> it's on the game's end, man. Holy crap, you're hurting though. Shadow Mistress is OP. You just wrecked that hero. Is that 3 billion damage? <laughs> That's a lot of damage, man. That's crazy. Okay, so that was an easy victory. So I want, before before we continue, I should probably want to watch your house things. Homestead, sure. Let's see. Let's see a good homestead, eh? Cost us 32,000. Let's claim furniture coins. It's white and simplistic. I kind of like that. It looks nice. You have some statues. Uh... Yeah, you have some Halloween stuff. It's quite nice. I like it. Your angel stuff. Um, our level 67 Raven, Raven 64 uh, Venus, and like level 65 Demetria. Raven is giving a lot of stats, much more than mine does, even though I just got her. Uh, augment, you're working on augmenting her. She, it's, she's good. Okay, now that we've looked at that, let's head back over to Battle Royale. Uh, which I have to click on here for. I It's probably over here, but let's just click here instead. Uh, so let's fight Kiev. Uh, why not? Why don't we? Aragor. Kiev, please. Okay, yeah, it doesn't surprise me that everyone else is dying in your team, though. It doesn't surprise me at all. Uh, okay, yeah, we'll, we'll find Kiev hopefully very soon. Aragog, uh, boss, some high, he is high bass rating, he's using, I don't even know what they're using, that's a main focus, you can easily see by the revolutions of things, if we don't find Kiev in the, um, in the last one, I suppose we'll have some issues, but I assume we'll find Kiev, uh, you don't have a lot of diamonds so that we can purchase extra attempts, that's a, that's a problem, so hopefully we'll find Kiev here, otherwise we'll just improvise, here Kiev is. Okay, 3 billion bath rating. They're using a Moira as their main focus, I would assume. I would assume that they're using a Moira as their main focus. We'll see. We'll see how they look. And I can probably judge early on. <sighs> Hopefully it's not as laggy this time around. But I have a bad feeling it may be as laggy as last time around. So we'll see. Yeah, that's a Moira focus, alright. Moira the Judicator. I'm pretty certain that it's a Moira, right? So they're also using Kitsune. Uh, so, you're too... <laughs> yeah. Okay, it's a main focus. It, it's a Moira focus, my bad. Are you dodging a lot? Yeah, you're dodging a little bit. Not not every time, though, but you're dodging a lot. Conviction, she's doing it again. Holy crap, she's hurting, man. Moira is not to be underestimated. Remember, you have... You, you have freaking 1.9 billion HP, and she's kind of wrecking you, but 
Yeah, look, you're so close to dying. Damn, and you're losing defense as well. This is definitely a close battle, and she's immune. Moira is super OP. I want to look at Kiev's Moira, actually. Her Moira is nice. I like that. Dimension Strike. And uh, she's going to respawn as a card, which is fine. But yeah, you're both pretty much one-shotting each other, which is kind of hilarious. <coughs> Yeah, like the damage here is being, it's its crazy. Like your normal hit is kind of wrecking them. Okay, so nice job beating Kiev. Of course, it's its very OP. You're very OP killing someone at 3 billion. However, I want to look at Kiev's uh, Moira. Because now I'm actually super interested. Uh, where, is, where would Kiev be? Costume power. Uh, yeah, we haven't even looked at your costumes and whatnot. Uh, where, where would Kiev be? Is Kiev anywhere here? Um, maybe here. Yeah, because Kiev seems like they'd been in a good rank, right? Well, you're rank 185, so I suppose not. 130, 113. I don't think we were able to see Kiev, but I assume Kiev is pretty powerful. <laughs> uh, but yeah, how, how do we go over to your clothings and whatnot? Uh, this is the thing where you guys can call me stupid. Is it just here? Because enchantment, it's not enchantment, it's not required lineup, it's not skills. Oh, it's clothing, obviously. Yeah, sorry, I was just having a brain fart figuring out where to click. That's when you know it's been a while since you've been playing this game. <laughs> uh, yeah, you're using the auras that we've seen. Uh, codex. You have a pretty high costume charm, giving you a lot of attack and defense. What's your? You don't get dodge from it, but you're getting some attack. Yeah, I guess you're very, very new to that, I assume, because you don't have it too high for right now. I think this is that vampire. Don't get me. Don't be angry if I have it wrong. Meet it. Who the hell is that? Also, oh, 30 billion. But this is an older server, okay? Also, they're not in a guild, which is interesting. But yeah, you're freaking. You're the the damage percentages is crazy, man. Your agility and defense and everything. I think you could easily kill my main. At being level 86, meanwhile my main is like 122 or 121 or something like that. But yeah, if you guys did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe, it's a nice account. And yeah, if you want to see more, let me know. Oh, no. oh man. I want to do a jump player showcase as well soon. So yeah, look out for that. And the background hopefully is fixed by next video. Have a nice one. Goodbye.